Hi, I'm Scott with Marks Mobility. Today I'm going to show you how to replace the front and rear tires on the Zero Turn 10 by Pride Mobility, so stay tuned. To change the tires on the Zero Turn 10, we're going to need a few tools. Uh, the first, you're going to want something to prop the scooter up with. So I've got one of these hand jacks. You can get these from Sunrise Medical. Uh, we're also going to need for the rear tires a three quarter inch socket and a half inch socket for the front tires as well as a flathead screwdriver to pop the little caps off covering the wheels. I'm going to start with the front tire here. I'm going to grab my flathead screwdriver and I'm going to pop this little cap off. And that exposes the bolt in here. Next I'm going to take my hand jack. Uh, if you don't have one of these you can throw some wood under here, pretty much anything to prop up the scooter. Uh, I would just rest it on the frame, but I'm going to use these hand jacks here and then lift this up just enough so that the tire free spins and I can pull it off once I take the bolt out. So this is a half inch bolt. Uh, you could use 13 millimeter if you don't have a half inch. I recommend a socket set. I'm going to be using an impact drill just to save some time. But it's just a bolt like this. And then you got a washer and a lock washer. So make sure you keep track of those. And then the tire just slides off. There is no key or anything in here. It's just completely rounded as you can see. Uh, so when you do put the new tire back on or if you're just taking off the old one and putting the old one back on, it just slides in. There is a bearing in there so you might have to wiggle it a little bit. Uh, if the bearing is giving you trouble, you can get your uh, flathead in there and move it around but it should just slide on just like that then we're going to take our bolt put it back in start threading it by hand and then finish it off with your socket set and just make sure it's tight uh, you don't have to death tighten it down but that's not going anywhere and it is freely moving then we'll just pop our cap back in now we're going to do the rear tires the rear tires are going to be very similar to the front tires. I'm going to start by popping this cap out. There we go. You can see the nut is bigger and it's a big lock nut. Um, that's why we got our three quarter inch instead of our half inch. But first I'm going to start by propping the scooter up again. So I have it up on the jack. Now I'm going to get my socket set. And it's just a single lock nut. And then there is a washer in here. But that'll also come off with the tire. When I pull the tire off, just don't lose it. There it goes. <clears throat> and the tire slides off. So you can see this tire is different and there is a key right here. Uh, just keep track of that. This one's in there pretty good, but sometimes they do pop out. Uh, you want to make sure that it's sitting there securely like that. Um, so and then when we do put our tire back on that is going to line up here because these are our drive motors that is what you know engages with the tire and make sure it turns with the unit um, so i'm going to go ahead and put this back on like i said make sure that is lined up um, and make sure that that key is in there it's kind of hard to see sometimes you can look around Like I can just barely see the key and lining it up with the tire. There it goes. We put our washer on, put our lock nut on. I'll go ahead and tighten this again. There we go. It doesn't have to be super tight because this is a lock nut as long as it's uh, firm on there. We'll put our cap back in and put the scooter back down. This has been how to change the front and rear tires on the Pride Mobility Zero Turn 10 scooter. If you like this video or if you have any questions uh, or you want to order one of these products, feel free to give us a call. We'd love to answer any questions or get you a unit if you would like one. And thank you for watching. Hi, I'm Mark. And my name is Alex. We're co-owners of Mark's Mobility. I started this company in 1995. We sell many products, not just what you see in this video. If you have any questions or concerns, please call us at the number below at 800-677-6200.
9-3. Thank you and have a wonderful day.